Jeff Demore here, Converter Accessory Corporation. Today I'd like to speak with you about one of the products we manufacture that's it's a lightweight through shaft and core cone support for holding rolls of material. Recently we had a customer approach us asking us for a simple lightweight method for holding a relatively heavy roll of material. Uh, the roll of material is 500 pounds, approximately 24 inches wide, and uh, comes on a 6 inch diameter core. Uh, so what we opted for was CAC's uh, unique hollow steel through shaft, which is very lightweight, and core cone support, which are very simple. Um, this is CAC's hollow steel through shaft, and um, it's 3 inch, for this application we opted for 3 inch diameter, so the outside of this is 3 inch diameter. And um, if this was solid, it would weigh approximately 80 pounds, the complete assembly. But um, being hollow, it's very lightweight. This unit only weighs, this only weighs about 22 pounds. In the ends of the uh, hollow steel tubing, we mounted um, a solid steel um, uh, headers, and we welded them into the tubing. Then we um, machined square ends for the customer's application and the square ends are hardened so when they drop this into their safety chucks or whatever method they have for holding the shaft um, the ends are hardened for that application so they don't wear out but this whole assembly only weighs about 22 pounds I'll put this on the scale so you can see so it is very lightweight um, again if it was solid it would be much heavier so this makes it very easy for the operators to lift and handle for uh, changing rolls of material in the unwind or rewind application. Um, the assembly, this is the assembly with the core cones mounted. And these are, again, core cones are made for six inch diameter cores. And the complete assembly only weighs about 35 pounds. So that's a nice, lightweight, simple method of holding a roll of material in an unwind or rewind application. CAC's core cones for this application included a split bushing option for locking to the through shaft. So um, inside these core cones are bored out and then there's a split bushing mounted. Um, this set screw will tighten the split bushing and this split bushing will close onto the center shaft. Instead of the set screw locking directly to the center shaft and that saves the center shaft from being marred over time. In addition with the split bushing, you get a more concentric locking. Um, one of the things that people don't realize with the uh, hollow steel center shaft is that beams get most of their strength from the outside diameter. So when you make them hollow, uh, you lose very little beam strength, but you gain a lot of weight savings. And that's the reason why we make them hollow. This, this shaft with the roll mounted on these core cones um, at maximum deflection will only deflect about 20 thousandths of an inch maximum. So it's very strong and um, very lightweight. In addition to core cones, if that's not, if that's not the type of uh, core support method or core holding method that you like, um, we also manufacture air chucks which are made of aluminum, aluminum tubing as well, so they're very lightweight. We manufacture mechanical chucks which use uh, rollers that engage the core and we also manufacture end plugs, which normally will go with one of these two types of method of holding a core. All these methods are all lightweight, easy for operators to handle, and um, ensure very uh, 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 high torque core locking uh, with your machine. Thank you.